Hey guys and welcome to Morkefish channel. In today's video I'm going to show you the fence against the single strike. So this technique what I'm going to show you I learned it in the Wichun class while I was training but probably you can find the same techniques in the different styles. I'm going to show you three different options from the one base and base is a Wing Chun guard. So if you are not familiar with Wing Chun guard you look like this. And here we have a Man Sao, hand which is searching for contact, and we have a Wu Sao, hand which is protecting you. And two of your hands creating two gates for your opponent to pass it before he can get to you. And as you can see, here we create nice long distance, so you have more time for reaction. So as I said before, for this technique, base is a Wing Chun guard, which is like this. And here, I'm going to just switch from the left guard to the right guard. So, looks like this, hop, 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 hop. So, when he going to punch me, I have to redirect his punch, so I'm moving his arm a little bit to the side, so his fist will not hit my face, and then I have to slide here and close the distance. So, look like this, boom, I just switch him from the left guard to the right guard. So in the first option I'm going to show you how to use this base for takedown. Okay, so when you're already here, you have to, next step is to put our hip to his hip. And important is that you have to go a little bit further, so it's not 50-50, because when it's 50-50, I can sweep him and he can sweep me. But when I go a little bit further, then I'm breaking his balance, and I can sweep him and take him down much easier. And now I'm going to show you the same technique with my partner, not with the dummy, so you can see how it will look with the real person. Okay, so let's move to another technique. This time I will not go for takedown, but I'm going to go for choke. And this is going to be a blood choke, so I'm cutting the blood circulation. And again, I just switch from the left guard to the right guard, the base is the same. So when he's punching me, I just redirect the punch, come close, and instead of going for the sweep, you have to go close to the feet and change to the side. So. Pa, pa, pa. Instead of going all the way, I have to make two steps, one to his feet, second to the side. And then, when I am here, I have to just grab my elbow and squeeze, creating the choke. So, it's going to be like this, like pa, pa, pa. It's a really quick technique. Pam, pam, pam. Pam, pam, pam. One more time. He's punching me. I just moving. Okay, so now I'm going to show you this technique with my partner so you can see how it looks on the real person. Okay, so in the last technique, we're just going to combine these two techniques from before. Hop, I'm taking him down. So when you're already down, then we have to just grab our elbow and create the choke as we did before. And, you know, you follow the move and then you have to just be quick to catch your elbow and grab and create the choke. On this dummy, it's difficult to show with this technique because he have not natural arms, they're on the front not like in the normal person. But now I'm going to show you how this technique would look with the real person. Thank you. 
probably from this base you can do much more you can be just creative or do what suits you best and i hope you enjoyed this kind of content thank you for watching see you next time